click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, now we will see one more problem based on calculation of floats before we jump to the next topic. Let's talk about calculation of floats in one more problem. No, this is a problem with activities A to I. So we are near about 8 to 10 activities here and we are given the dependence and the duration of each of the activities. Let's first draw the network diagram and then we can proceed further. We have activities A, B and C, jiske pehle dash matlab koi bhi preceding activity nahi hai. That means A, B and C will be my initial activity. So A, B and C. So we have A, B and C as the initial activities. After C we have E and after A and B we have D. Now since A and B have the common tell, I can't join them directly and therefore I need to have a dummy here. So I'll take a dummy downside. यहां से निकलेगा हमारा D और C के बाद आएगा E Now once D and E is combined I will have F and G So I have F and I have G and then after F I will have H as my final activity and I will be after G as the final activity. So we are done with the diagram. I will put the numbers to the nodes first. So here it will be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8 and then we will put the duration A car duration 1 B car duration 2 C 4 D 3 E 2 F 5 G 2 H 4 and I 3 so you are done with the numbering and the durations now we'll work out the forward and the backward calculations first we'll start with the 0 sabse pehle hoga 0 plus 1 at 3 it will be 0 plus 2 or 1 plus 0 0 plus 2 or 1 plus 0 it will be 2 at 4 it will be 0 plus 4 at 5 it will be 2 plus 3 5 or 4 plus 2 6 whichever is more 6 plus 5 11 6 plus 2 8 and at the final point it will be 11 plus 4 15 or 8 plus 3 11 whichever is more and we'll go for the backward calculation now which is more tricky I'll put the same number here 15 15 minus 3 12 15 minus 4 11 at node 5 it will be 11 minus 5 6 or 12 minus 2 10 whichever is less here it will be 6 minus 2 4 6 minus 3 3 
at 2 it will be 3 minus 0 3 and at 1 it will be 3 minus 1 2 3 minus 2 1 or 4 minus 4 0 whichever is less so you are done with the backward and the forward calculations now I'll make the table So we are done with the table now, we will first calculate the earliest starting time and the latest finishing time. For earliest starting time we will look at the left hand side at the tail of the activity and for the latest finishing time we will look at the right hand side at the head of the activity. So for activity A, tail pe left side mein 0, head pe right side mein 3, so this will be 0 and this will be 3. For activity B, tail is 0. Head is again 3, so 0. For activity C, tell 0, head 4. For activity D, tell 2, head 6. Activity E, tell 4, head 6. For activity F, L6 head 11 for activity G L6 head 12 for activity H L11 head 15 and for activity I L8 head 15 next is our calculation of earliest finishing time for earliest finishing time the formula will be earliest starting time plus duration and for latest starting time the formula will be latest finishing time minus duration so this will be 0 plus 1 0 plus 2 0 plus 4 2 plus 3 4 plus 2 6 plus 5 6 plus 2 11 plus 4 and 8 plus 3 for LST it will be 3 minus 1 3 minus 2 4 minus 4 6 minus 3 6 minus 2 11 minus 5 12 minus 2 15 minus 4 15 minus 3 Next is my head slack and tail slack. A ka head pe difference is 2, tail pe 0. B head 1, tail 0. C head 0, tail 0. D 6 minus 6, 0, tail pe 3 minus 2, 1. E head pe 0, tail pe bhi 0 F head pe 0, tail pe bhi 0 G 12 minus 8, head pe 4, 6 minus 6, tail pe 0 H head pe 0, tail pe bhi 0 I head pe 0, tail pe 4 Now my total float will be Total float will be latest starting time minus earliest starting time or latest finishing time minus earliest finishing time. So difference between FT, FT or difference between ST, ST will be called as the total float. Mera FT, FT ka difference aega 3 minus 1, 3 minus 2, 4 minus 4, 
सिक्स माइनस फाइव सिक्स माइनस सिक्स लेवन माइनस लेवन ट्वेल्व माइनस एट फिफ्टीन माइनस फिफ्टीन एंड फिफ्टीन माइनस लेवन सो माई टोटल फ्लोट विल बी जीरो फॉर सी ई एफ एंड एच सो दे कैन बी कॉल्ड एज द क्रिटिकल एक्टिविटीज ना फ्री फ्लोट विल बी टोटल फ्लोट माइनस हेड स्लैक एंड इंडिपेंडेंट फ्लोट विल बी फ्री फ्लोट माइनस टेल स्लैक सो टोटल फ्लोट माइनस हेड विल गेट मी द फ्री फ्लोट सो टू माइनस टू वन माइनस वन जीरो माइनस जीरो वन माइनस जीरो जीरो माइनस जीरो जीरो माइनस जीरो फोर माइनस फोर जीरो माइनस जीरो एंड फोर माइनस जीरो विल बी ना इंडिपेंडेंट फ्लोट विल बी फ्री फ्लोट माइनस टेल स्लैक इट विल बी जीरो 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 एंड जीरो If at any point any of your floats calculations are negative, you have to write it as zero, because your float is a time. Time can't be negative. Therefore, any negative float indicates that the float will be zero. If float calculation gives negative answer. then write zero against such float so it can be total float it can be free float it can be independent float agar zero ki jagah pe negative values aata hai to you have to ignore the negative values and simply represent it with a zero so with this we are done with the calculations my critical activities will be i got a 0 0 0 and 0 mere paas char zeros hai so i got c e f and h so my critical activities will be c e f and h shall be my critical activities thanks for watching this video do subscribe to our channel ikida